Zambia's relationship with China continues to evolve, grounded not just in trade and infrastructure, but in knowledge. The 2025 China-Zambia Research and Development Exchange Forum held in Lusaka has become another example of that cooperation, delivering real measurable value. The event themed Global Perspectives Local Impact, enhancing research and development through student exchanges, brought together students and faculty from the University of Zambia, Kopadot University, and Mulungushi University, alongside counterparts from Xinhao University in China. The forum was coordinated by Lichi Community Solutions Limited, working closely with the Minister of Education, Science and Technology and Commerce. At a time when Zambia continues to face serious power shortages, this kind of collaboration is not just timely, it is necessary. Millions of Zambians still live without reliable electricity. This affects not only homes, but also schools, clinics, farms, and small businesses. That's why government is responding practically. Under the termination of the global vision, local folks strengthening research and development. This firm is not only an exchange of ideas, but also a virtual platform for deepen practical cooperation between China and Zambia in the new phase of high quality biology development. While we continue expanding solar power access and investing in the energy sector, we believe academic institutions must also play an active role in the country's recovery and development. The presence of Xinhua University, one of the world's top-ranked institutions, is not symbolic. It's demo it demonstrates a clear commitment from China to work with Zambia on ideas and not just investment. Through this exchange, Zambians and Chinese students are now working together to study rural energy challenges, document local conditions, and design scalable solutions that respond to real needs. In his address, Minister of Education, Honorable Douglas Sia Kalima pointed out to this exchange as an example of how student research can fit directly into national development. Students present, this is your moment. You are the architects of tomorrow's solutions. Use this opportunity not only to learn from each other, but to envision the Zambia and the world and utilize opportunities in Zambia to bring out practical solutions that would be expanded to other developing countries. He encouraged students to treat their work not as an assignment, but as a responsibility to the communities they serve. He also noted that Zambia's rural education rate remains low and that young innovators must help close that gap. Uh, we are glad to be here at this innovative forum where we can at least exchange notes with our fellow colleagues, especially those from Tsinghua University and those from the Copa Perot University. Personally, as the chairperson for the University of Zambia Engineering Society, I'm delighted that we are here and we are learning more about renewable energy. President Akainde HLM has working trips to China laid the foundation of the forum, like this one. Those engagements were built on a shared understanding that Zambia must invest in research, adopt technology, and support local innovation. What we are seeing now is that those visits are producing results. Lichi Community Solutions Limited has played an important role in making this platform a success. Their efforts show what is possible when a local initiative meets international collaboration. This is about building institutional links, encouraging student-led innovation, and solving challenges from the ground up. As government, we continue to support partnerships that create space for Zambia's youth to think, explore, and invent. Energy challenges will not be resolved by infrastructure alone. They will be solved by people, people who understand the problem and are empowered to do something about it. Zambia's future will be powered by knowledge. We are not just saying it, we are building it.